Postal by Running With Scissors. It is a PC game from 1997. Uh, Postal is an isometric 3D shooter uh, surrounding with a mist of controversy upon it. I, I played it, downloaded it, played it, and uh, deleted it because it was overall a meh game. Uh, not as fun as the sequel. The sequel is just a pure guilty pleasure. <laughs> But, uh, I'll get to that when I get to that. But, this game, um, when it comes to controversy in games, sometimes it's a misunderstanding, sometimes it's just a pretty kind of seed notion by some jackass politician or lawyer, Jack Thompson. Um, like, say, a misunderstanding would be some feminists get their hands up in the air, oh my god, they're having sex in this game, like some, uh, I don't know, just uh, man-hating feminists in uh, the Mass Effect game because you have the job to, you, I mean, not the job, but you have the option to have sex with one of your companions, one of your party members, and it's done in a tasteful manner. You know, it's done kind of almost like a dreamlike sequence, you know, lights are dim, you probably just see the inner thigh, no genitals whatsoever, and you take her to bed and all that established, you had sex. So there's no interaction with the sex, there's no, like, thrust button, no come on her face, you know, just like that, you know, there's no titwank, it's just, you know, it's not interactivity, it's not rape play, you know. And, like, with Bully, with Rockstar's North game, I liked Bully, it was fun, it felt like a, a John Hughes movie, it had cheeky humor, it was basically GTA Jr., and people are like saying, oh, it was a Columbine simulator, it's no, your character is, is kind of an anti-hero who beats up the bullies and stabilizes this school. And he's an anti-hero, you know, he has his flexions, but over, he's a reluctant hero. But uh, with Postal, it's basically just a bi, uh, bi curious thrill to be a religiously insane guy, and you think everyone has this disease and you're killing them. And in between of each level, there's this kind of biblical-type quotes, you know? And just like, I will bathe in their blood, and God will blah blah blah. <laughs> It plays like an arcade game, you know? It, it feels like it's ice, it's isometric, you know? You turn around, you shoot, and, and the buttons themselves, I found, really. Running around with the mouse and the with the control uh, pad on the keyboard. It was quite awkward, I found, but this would work better with just a straight-up joystick and two buttons, you know? You know, you can probably buy one of those Street Fighter, Street Fighter or... Uh, other type of findy uh, arcade pads you can get, but those take up a lot of retail space in your house, so... Eh. Overall, it's an okay game. I say check out the sequel. It is far better. It's far funnier. It has Gory... Uh, what was it? Gary Coleman? Was it Gary Coleman? Yeah, Gary Coleman. Uh, you know, we talked about Willis. Um, and, uh, yeah, and with the... It's... Eh. You know, you, you you'd have fun playing the original Grand Theft Auto, which was top down, asymmetric. And uh, one thing about the old Grand Theft Auto games, I didn't like you had to hold like a button to run in a direction. It was just eh. Legend of Zelda did better way back in the day. Uh, but uh, I'm kind of trailing off. Um, if you're curious, just it's just a straight up by curious thrill. That's it. Nothing more. May the force of evil become confused on your house. I'll be reviewing some other games from great companies like Atlas and whatnot. Please stay tuned. Peace.